Trade Union Congress has called on the Inspector General of Police to ensure that adequate security measures are put in place to ensure the planned August protest on the economic hardship is not hijacked by miscreants. Our labor correspondent, Ekaite Ibot, who covered the briefing, reports. Briefing newsmen in Abuja on the state of the nation, the President Trade Union Congress, Comrade Festus Asifo, stressed that the Nigerian police is binded by a police act as well as the constitution to provide adequate security for protesters to ensure a peaceful protest. He also clearly spells out union's position on the protest. Our concern really, you know, we have several affiliates who's, uh, who's whose jobs and whose functions are out there in public. So we don't want a situation whereby uh, the protest goes on and at the end of the day it leads to violence. So we want to hear by call on the Inspector General of Police and the entire security agencies uh, to do everything possible to provide security for whoever intends to carry out protest so that such protest will not degenerate into chaos because we are very keen on that. While attributing the present hardship to currency fluctuation, Comrade Osifu harped on the need for partnership among the three tiers of governments to ameliorate the situation. So as of today, nobody has reached out to us uh, that they want to protest. Nobody has asked for our collaboration. We don't even know those that want to protest. Uh, so uh, how do you expect us to participate in a protest that we don't even know who is organizing it? TEC further called on government to address the current insurgency across the country to enable farmers to go back to their farms. Ikaite Ibut.